With MobiWork, managing schedules and keeping track of your field operations has never been so easy. A simple look at the schedule and your office users will see what is planned, what has been done, and what is currently happening. Double bookings, inefficient routes, lost jobs, or missed appointments are a thing of the past. MobiWork provides a 360-degree live view of your field operations with multiple schedule views to accommodate your company's specific needs and the common situations your team is faced with. Listed at the top of the schedule views, you will notice multiple tabs listed for different views of your MobiWork schedule. These are all dependent on the date and users selected in the search area panel. The composite tab is selected by default and lets you see the schedule in all three views at once. The timeline, map, and list views. The timeline panel or tab provides users a way of using a simple glance to visualize in real time what's happening in the field. Each job is color coded to represent the live job status. Green means the job has been completed. Blue means the mobile worker is in transit to the job. Yellow means the mobile worker is on site. And teal means the job has been dispatched and scheduled. If you hover over any of the jobs with your mouse cursor, MobiWork provides an easy to view tooltip that will give users more detailed information about that specific work order. The orange links shown will allow users one click access to things such as redispatching the job, viewing the full job entity, and even seeing the current weather for the job location. The map view is used for quickly viewing all work order locations on the map and the route or user they are assigned to, including any unassigned work orders. This allows for fast and route efficient scheduling by your users in charge of dispatching jobs. With an easy way of seeing the exact location of work orders that still need to be assigned, your office users can effectively dispatch these work orders to the right mobile worker for the job. The list view allows you to see the work orders that match your selected date in a table format. With this list view, users can easily retrieve, access, and update multiple work orders in one shot. The dropdown provided lists multiple different list results to be shown. With this kind of view, MobiWork has a drag and drop feature that can be used. When holding down the work order line item by the drag and drop icon, when the word drag appears, you can efficiently schedule a job to a particular user on the calendar view. For day, week, and month, the corresponding calendar view will be shown depending on the options selected, along with the list view provided below. Work orders can be color coded based on the user it is assigned to rather than the job status. This can always be set up within your schedule settings. You can also collapse the map or list views, giving users a full display of the calendar. This can be very convenient when viewing the calendar in the week or month tab views. Lastly, the Assets tab allows you to see all of the assets that have been or will be used, for example, to be serviced or needed for a job, for the work orders in the date range and for the users specified. This is particularly helpful to keep track of the assets that are needed to perform the service and to make sure that the assets are available and not overbooked. Other than the different views provided, MobiWork also has a search area to easily select a different time range or set of users. In addition to a free text search, MobiWork lets you create, manipulate, and save searches custom to your operations, as well as give you some default save searches. The new search button will show a list of search criteria you can use to search for particular calendar views or even create new save searches that will be listed within this search area panel. Show all, today, and all mobile users are default save searches automatically provided for you to use. When navigating to the schedule page, you will notice the all mobile users save search is selected by default. When creating new searches, users will have the ability to customize the default save search if selecting the checkbox provided within the search criteria.